So, Adam, a few weeks out now until the fight with Sergei Kamitsky. How's your preparations going? My preparation is brilliant, you know. Um, after each fight I have, everything seems to be improving. I think this has been my best camp. My sparring's been spot on. My training's going fine. No injuries. Weight's all right. So, you know, it's definitely my best, my best training camp yet. Now, Kamitsky is a guy that quite a lot of people in Britain know about. Obviously, he's beat like a Buglioni, he's been in with Martin Murray. So, is it fair to say this is the toughest test of your career? Definitely, without a doubt. You know, he's not just coming over to make the numbers up. He's not coming to survive. He's coming to win. And you know, I'm gonna make sure on that night that that doesn't happen. Now, during your career, you've obviously got reputation of being a guy that knocks most people out. Do you think in this fight you might have to go the full 12 rounds and that in some ways might even be uh, beneficial to yourself? I never go into a fight expecting it to go 12 rounds. I want to get him out of the way as early as what I can. But, you know, this I'm not expecting him just to keel over the first time I hit him. So, you know, it's important that my preparation is spot on and I'm fit enough to go the 12 rounds if I need to. But, you know, I'm expecting to stop him. But a lot of people maybe won't be expecting that. They think I'm probably win on points or there might be an upset. But I think if I hit him, he, he should go eventually. Now, as we said, this is the, the best opponent of your career so far. So win this, what next? I just leave all that to Richard. Um, my ultimate goal is to become a world champion. That's what I want to do. I'm not bothered how I do it who it's against, where it is, I just want to be a world champion. So hopefully, you know, this this fight, if I win this and win it in good style, it'll climb me up that ladder and I'll be one step closer to where I want to be. And this is obviously at the Sheffield Arena. Kel Brook is a world champion, top of the bill. You must look at him and what he's achieved and think that's where I want to be. I want to be uh, top of the bill at this arena myself. Absolutely, you know, Kel's a very, very good friend of mine. Um, I think he's done unbelievable in his boxing career um, up to now, and I think he, the best is yet to come. He's, you know, he's went over there, took took that belt off Sean Porter, and now he's defending it at Sheffield Arena. You know, it's it. That's where I want to be in, you know, in one or two years' time. I, I want to be doing what he's doing. Excellent. Well, best of luck on March 28th and best of luck with your world title aspirations. Cheers, Andy.